hello, hello, beautiful Capricorns. Good morning, everybody. I hope everyone had a great weekend. Um, the weather was kind of a mixed bag, but you know what? I got a lot done, and I hope everybody got to enjoy themselves this weekend. I'm pulling up on some energies here for a Capricorn. It's sort of like a mixed bag. So let's see what the messages are for the beautiful Capricorns. What is it that Capricorn needs to be aware of, Spirit? What do you want to communicate to the beautiful Capricorns about their situations? Capricorn. Well, Father of the Sky, God, I release the weight of the world from my shoulders. Give it to God. They're willing to take it on. Just give it to the universe. What's ever troubling you, bringing you down, having a difficult time with. The inner temple, life lessons. I go within my shadow for deep spiritual growth. So a lot of you, indeed, uh, this is like hermit em energy. Seeking, soul searching. The Enchanter Dream. I wish upon a star and my dreams come true. I know it's something big. The Amazon Queen. Oh, yeah. I am a devoted warrior of the universe. So, indeed, you are. Um, capitalizing at this time, soul searching, like trying to fulfill your wishes. Spirit is saying, give me your burdens. I will help carry them for you. Embody the priestess. I am an embodiment of the divine feminine. So for you divine feminines, male or fe female, who are going through this hermit situation, soul searching, spirit saying, just give me the burdens because I'm about to fulfill some type of wish for you. Your dreams are, you're wishing upon a star and your dreams are coming true so you're like been through the battle like the amazon queen male or female energy just take it as it resonates whatever you're fighting battling going through spirit saying give me your burdens you know you don't have to carry them alone um it said i am embodiment of the divine feminine so that is a lot of forward growth creative endeavors making your wishes come true, bringing them to fruition. Um, the goddess of balance, Electra here, I create and foster reciprocal relationships. Indeed, so if you've been ghosted or gone through a period of isolations, Spirit is saying, cast your burdens upon me. I'm going to help you carry this load. Make your wish. Set your intentions. You're the embodying the like the Amazon queen here. Hello, strong warrior. And whatever you're working on, your creative endeavors now, the divine feminine is here. That doesn't mean that you are a divine feminine, although you certainly most likely are. For the male energies, it's like you're embodying that. A quality of wishing upon a star, setting your intentions, working hard, being the warrior, but whatever you're working on is going to bear fruit. And if you're creating reciprocal relationships, male or female, things that you put your time and energy into are reciprocated back to you. So like that's relationships but it's also to do with work projects like if you are working hard at something make sure that you're getting back out of it what you put into it co-creating my abundance mindset attracts endless blessings with the sacred orchard that is creative projects forward growth bearing fruit and this is co-creating 
you're adapting the mindsets of abundance and it by doing so it attracts endless possibilities wow let's see capricorn what's going on to the beautiful capricorns you're in a power period that's what it's telling me soul searching wishing upon a star your dreams come true forward growth development bearing fruit you're in a power period capricorn I <laughs> like this the amazon queen the battle male or female it's just the the card you've been through a battle but you're like a warrior of the universe a devoted warrior yang balance that <laughs> mm -hmm. it's faded i can't make this stuff up guys whatever you're working on whatever you wished for whatever you're dreaming of whatever you're co-creating with the universe it's faded it's gonna happen soulmates many of you are getting soulmates equal reciprocity it's faded this soulmate whatever's going on for you the person that's entering your life round and round so this is like what comes around goes around this is also about if you were in a like a cycle with a soulmate know that it was just faded but this is new love this is like a past life soulmate but it's fairly balanced yeah the yin to your yang that came out yang now it's coming out yin equal reciprocity equal balance remaining poised in control balanced poised is balance it's like this person is standing on one foot but is in no fear of falling they're completely void poised in balance oh my god community is involved here so this is like co-creating with the universe it could be that is your community it is destined whatever this is it could be a person in your community or you're working with a community or you're co-creating with a community but it's happy happy hello you get this wish happy Staying in the here and now. The past is the past. The future is the future. Living for today. You're in the present. But this is. Your dreams are coming true. Many of you are getting this. It's fated for the soulmate to enter your life. It is. It's balanced. It's reciprocal. It was intended to be. It's fated to be. And you will be happy, happy. I can't believe this. Capricorns. Fighting through it. That's why you're the warriors. You fight for what you want. You fight for... You live in the present. You're not in the past. You're in the present. The here and the now. And the here and the now is saying that you're going to be happy, happy you're going to get through this you are whatever you wished for is fated to happen work wise relationship wise jobs don't matter it doesn't matter it's all there it's equal reciprocity give and take balanced poised and you're going to be happy happy whatever you're working on your wish was it's coming true 
could be abundance. Loyalty, stability. King of Pentacles is your energy. Abundant. Staying strong, the warrior, courageous. If you get this, I can't make it up. It keeps wanting to appear, so it's your message. Abundance. King of Pentacles, hello. Capricorns are getting their wishes. I know you've been through this nine of sword energy, high stress sleepless nights but something is coming to light like you're getting an awareness about something something being revealed to you whatever it is it produces a lot of money you got the wheel of fortune things are changing staying in the here and now things are changing you're getting a, a reward a success a victory can't make it up, guys. You might be in the spotlight. But you're getting the accolades, attention. You might be penny-pinching, seriously. And Spirit is saying you may actually be blocking your blessings because your heart chakra may be closed. But this is also saying that things are about to change if you've been penny pinching, literally. You're going to be in this, things are changing. You might have been waiting for this. It could be a job opportunity. It could be like collaborating with communities. Um, working on a project, teaming up with someone. Or you might be waiting on a court judgment or ruling. But this is someone in a community working together hand in hand. Now you're either working in a community, in a community work type situation, or you're going to be teaming up with spirit to get these blessings. Either way, you get the judgment call in your favor. There's going to be a judgment call that's made about work, accolades. And yes, you've been in this energy, soul searching. What do I do here? Being saddened. Having obstacles. Having to fight for every damn thing you get. But you're getting it. Male or female, you're getting it. Success, pentacles, royalties, whatever it is. Um, you might be walking away from, like, somebody's watching you walk away. So it could very well be a job. It could be at a distance. Either or, you're getting success, victory. Wish fulfillment. Make a wish upon a star and there it is and look what it produces. Money. Pentacles. It's doing something you love. You will be celebrating. You might have to make a choice. And it could literally be if this is a soul mate, you will higher level of commitment. This is fated to happen. It's a person that's intended to be in your life. This is also you having to make a choice of where you're going to live, literally. Or where you're going to work. You might, okay, this is a church here. You might be down for the count. Some of you may be going through sickness as a real health. Some of you just might be like out in the cold, literally. But Spirit is saying, there's a house here for you. Work with the community. It could be charities, organizations. Follow your intuition, your instincts. You're being guided. Um, either or, you are getting something really abundant. 
you're getting success, but it's all to do with community. It is teaming up. It's working as a team. If you're not working as a community or in a community, it's working with spirit. Making wishes. You might be getting downloads or intuitive messages of what to do, but whatever it is, it's totally abundant. But you're going to have to make a decision about something, a choice. And it could very well be to do with work. And for others of you, this soulmate is someone you can work with. It's like they see you as their star and they're like, see your self-worth. And it's going to lead to marriage, just saying. For others of you, it's just to do with work. Mm. Justice. Balance. Stay balanced. Poised. Spirit knows that you've been wronged. And they want to make things right. To do with work. Ay, 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 ay. Because you've been working so damn hard, you put all your time and energy into this success, you're going to get it. You've been heavily burdened, like, but someone here, you're going to take a leap of faith. You're going to choose something to do with work that makes you this money. You're going for it, and you're going to hear some good news about it. You might be afraid to make this move. You're worried about it. <laughs> Spirit's saying, okay, if it's this love situation or work situation, you're manifesting this. You're co-creating with spirits or others or a community to get this. This is you getting a message of good news coming in fast. It's to do with a soulmate for many of you who love you truly, who make you very happy. Others of you are getting a message of good news that's coming in to do with something that you're going to love, that makes you happy and your circumstances change. End of the worry. Spirit saying, what was in the dark comes to life. What seemed dark is going to be happiness. Don't worry. Many of you, you're getting your emperor and others of you are getting jobs. This is self-employment, entrepreneurialship. Um, it's to do with work. Being your own boss, running your own company, being ahead of an organization. <laughs> but I can tell you that for the love situation, it's coming fast. It's a blessing, this job. It's coming fast. This blessing is coming fast. You get a lot of growth and success with this. I'm telling you, payday. You're passionate about it. It's something you're passionate about. You're excited about. You're on fire for. You're going to have a lot of haters. Just saying. A lot of jealous people that are jealous of this blessing you're getting. <laughs> but you don't care. You've been the Amazon queen king fighting for this, your happiness, and you get it. You've been fighting for it the whole time. It's coming. Well, you're cutting something out of your life that caused you a lot of pain, a lot of deception, sneaky bullshit. You make a choice to do something that you love. You reject that. Uh, either you're turning down an offer and taking this other offer that you love, 
something you're passionate about that you've been fighting for, you get it. You get to move forward to calmer waters. Things calm out. Things change. Mm -hmm. It's an offer. You might get a phone call. It might seem small to start. It's like starting small in a large corporation or industry that it's something that starts small but ends big. It's wish fulfillment. Something come crashing down. Or you've been through a tower, but you've you've gotten the truth about something. Yeah. You get the success. You see, you get clarity. You, either if it's a job or a relationship, no matters. It's here for both. Yep. It's your abundance. You're protected. This is protected. Whatever this success is, it is protected. It's sent by the angels. You, Spirit knows you were heartbroken, but this is wish fulfillment. Spirit knows you're angry at the heartbreak you've had to go through. And that you've been juggling your finances and not knowing what to do, but you're gonna about to take action. Things are might seem small, might have waited a long time for this, but it's coming. Yeah, Spirit is saying, don't block your blessings because they're big, Capricorn. It's abundant, it's long-term success, it's long-term stability. It's long-term rewards and a committed relationship for those of you seeking love. It's your soulmate. After being wounded, you've been down for the count, fighting like hell. And this is equal reciprocity, equal give and take, career or love or both. So you might be in need of a rest after all this, but you know what? It's your soulmate. Your passions are reignited. You take control. This is, you might have to move or drive to this. And it seems familiar to you, you know? It's like deja vu energy, this offer. Just saying you got good juju coming in. Big time Capricorn, so be blessed today.